Hi folks, Max from uh, Galaxy Note 2 Root.com uh, and uh, for this week's ROM of the week it is back to Max ROM. Uh, last time we looked at it it's been actually a couple months. Now the latest version is 5.0. Uh, some of the differences for those of you still on the older version, uh, the newer version uses uh, Bravia Engine 3 for better, better images. Um, a lot less lag uh, without the battery drain. I've noticed the latest version has really good battery life. Um, it has no overclocking, um, but uh, if you want great battery life, just uh, use that as it is. It is really fast as it is, but if you need overclocking, you can install a Perseus kernel. And also, I believe the toggles have been updated here, and which you can customize uh, using the advanced S here. Um, change the add more buttons, change the order, and I know some of you swear by this ROM, and yeah, I, I love it too. I think this is probably the best ROM you can get for the Sprint Note 2. Um, also, the latest version has Sprint native tethering working out of the box, um, so that also works along with the uh, Wi-Fi tether app, Trevi Wi-Fi tether app. So you have two methods of tethering uh, with the latest version. Uh, of course, Flash Player, and also it does come with two cameras, Note 2 camera, Android 4.2 uh, Photosphere camera. You can also grab the Android 4.3 Photosphere camera over at highonandroid.com. I'll have links to that if you want. It's, you just need to grab the APK, install it. And of course, one of the coolest things about um, this ROM is that it comes with three audio uh, mods here, Acid Audio Mod, uh, Dolby, Dolby Mobile, uh, and Nukezoid uh, ISO rewire. So great for those of you who like to tweak sound. Um, and uh, two gallery apps there. And let me show you some of this stuff in settings here. Uh, let me see. The lock screen options. Uh, if you go to lock screen options, you'll, you'll have the opportunity to change it to AOSP lock screen. Um, ink effects here. And um, also there is, uh, if you go to Expose Installer, go ahead and hit Install Update, reboot once, and then go back, open it, and go to Modules. Uh, make sure Expose Tweak Box is on. Reboot one more time, and then you'll be able to actually make use of this Tweak Box, uh, which is kind of cool. Um, you can tweak your status bar. You see I've customized my status bar uh, color there, clock color there. Uh, the background color seems to be not working for some reason. Not a huge deal, but I've changed my uh, signal strength bar to six bars, so you can see I've, I've got more bars. That's kind of cool. Uh, if you want CRT uh, effect, you can also do that, uh, which is this, boom. And it seems to only work for uh, actually uh, powering off your phone. And also a uh, battery and also phone. You can enable call recording and some of the other options here, uh, miscellaneous, um, you can change the uh, home key behavior. All right, so let me go ahead and show you the phone recording. I'm just gonna call 411 here. My phone's actually deactivated on Sprint, so I'm, you're gonna error see. I'm gonna get it, <laughs> error number 16. Three. But it does record just fine. Um, so very nice ROM, and the latest version is of course better than ever. And of course, uh, I forgot to tell you, multi-window, uh, transparent multi-window enable for all apps. Um, so that is nice. And uh, go ahead and take photos while browsing the web uh, or, or whatever you want to do. And uh, this is kind of fun to do. Anyway, check it out. Uh, the latest version 5.0 is stable and uh, better than ever. And this is probably the best uh, ROM out there. And also it does come with LMT uh, Pi Launcher if you want to activate that. Um, go ahead and do that. And where do we go? Yeah, you can do that. I have a full tutorial guide on that. Also, Light Manager if you want to uh, customize your uh, LED notifications uh, depending on which app receives notifications. Um, yeah, very solid ROM, of course. And for those of you who have tried it, uh, and for those of you who haven't tried it, definitely, if there's one ROM that I can recommend, it's going to be this Max uh, All-Star ROM. So check it out and do let me know what you think if you haven't tried it. And uh, as always, if you have a Note 2, don't forget to sign up for my email list at uh, galaxynote2root.com. We update you once a week with ROM of the Week tips, hacks, and more. 
And also, if you're on YouTube, please hit that like button for me here. Subscribe button down there. And I'll see you guys soon. Uh, have a great July 4th. And stay high on Android.